Welcome to the user manual video for Plavi ES9542 R Press Printer. In this tutorial, we will walk you through every step to ensure a smooth and efficient printing experience. Loading paper. Press the green power button to switch on the winder. Then switch the printer on using the power switch on the front of the printer. Place the roll onto the holder, ensuring it is properly centered and aligned. Lift the roll holder, which utilizes a pneumatic system to secure the roll, making the process simpler and more efficient. Activate the pneumatic system by pressing the nozzle against the valve of the core holder and forcing air into it. This automatically secures the roller. Setting up media on the unwinder, carefully pull the paper from the roll and guide it through the first set of rollers. Make sure it is centered and smooth. The web guide must first be set to the center position on the display. Continue to pull the paper through the web guide rollers and the sensor. The web guide keeps the paper straight and in line. Make sure to feed the paper through the web position sensor so that it comes close to the arrow position. When the paper has been aligned with the arrow on the sensor, the setting must be confirmed on the display with on. Switch on the sensors for dimension and speed control. Operate the black levers on the guide rollers. Pass the paper through the rollers under the dancer. Push the paper forward to the MPT and slide the paper guides to the edge of the media. Now, feed the paper to the rewinder side. Go to the machine's display and press the button 1 to activate the automatic paper feed. The paper will be fed through the printer and onto the rewinder side. You can adjust the feed length directly on the printer by navigating to the feed settings menu. Setting up media on the rewinder. Pull the paper from the roll and guide it through the rollers. Keep it centered and smooth. Set the web guide to the center position on the display. Continue pulling the paper through the web guide rollers and the sensor. The web guide ensures the paper stays straight. Feed the paper through the web position sensor, aiming for the arrow position. Slide a core of the correct size onto the roller holders of the rewinder. Fix the core with the pneumatic system. Fix the leading edge of the paper to the core of the rewinder. Operate the black levers on the guide rollers. Switch on the sensors for dimension and speed control. Now let's print using the printer driver. Open the printer settings for the Plavi ES9 RPS driver from the print dialog box in any application. Ensure the correct printer is selected. Set to up basic print settings. In the printer settings, go to the layout tab and press advanced button. Then select your paper size. For this example, we will use a custom size of 330 by 1200 millimeters. The media weight refers to the thickness of the paper. Using the wrong weight can lead to problems like non-toner fixing, curling or color misregistration. Media. Under the Paper Quality tab, you can choose the media. Choosing the correct media type ensures optimal toner application and prevents issues like fading or poor color reproduction. Color. Choose black and white for monochrome prints or color for color prints. Next, head to the Job Options tab to tweak the quality settings. Trapping is a feature that helps to hide unintended white edges that sometimes appear around color objects being printed on a page. Trapping helps to resolve imperfect registration. We have several color modes to choose from, depending on your printing needs. Graphic Pro. If you're printing high-quality images or graphic-heavy documents, select Graphic Pro. This mode gives the best color accuracy and vibrancy, perfect for professional prints. You can also click Options to customize the color settings further. If you want to print with the white toner, then head to the spot color section. Now let's take a closer look at the spot color usage method. Do not use. Select this if you do not want to apply white toner. Full page. This option applies white toner to the entire page. Data portion, excluding white, applies white toner only to non-white areas. 
data portion, including white. Applies white toner to all parts of the image, including white areas. When data portion is selected, the amount of spot color toner can be adjusted using the slider. You can set the value between 0 and 100 to control the density of the spot color. Printing only spot color toner, prints only white toner without any other colors. Use the application specification setting if the color spot color white is created in the print file. Special. If you need to mirror your print, select the mirror print option here, but we'll leave it unchecked. Once all your settings are configured, press OK. Ensure your printer is ready, then hit print in your application. Your Plavi ES9542R will now begin printing with the settings we have configured. You can quickly adjust your artwork using DTP software, like Adobe Illustrator. Now let's see how to remove the media from the winder. Before we start cutting, let's engage the red levers to secure the paper. Start by pulling down each lever firmly. These levers will lock the clamps in place, pressing them down onto the paper to prevent any movement. Now that the paper is securely fixed with the help of the red levers, a cut can be made through the guide provided. After cutting, the red levers can be released. Press button 2 on the display. The media is then ejected automatically. Release the roll by pressing the valve of the pneumatic system, then remove the media from the rewinder spool. Now let's see how to replace consumables. To begin with the toner cartridge, open the printer's front cover. Gently pull out the used toner cartridge and set it aside for proper disposal. Unpack the new toner cartridge, shake it gently to distribute the toner evenly and slide it into place until it clicks. Close the front cover and the printer will automatically detect the new cartridge and you are ready to print. Next, let's replace the image drum. Start by opening the front cover and locating it beneath the toner cartridges. Carefully lift the drum handle and pull it out, avoiding contact with the drum surface to prevent damage. Unpack the new drum, remove the orange transport locks, align it with the slots, and slide it in until it clicks. Now, let's move on to the waste toner box. Press the release lever and gently remove the full waste toner box. Slide in the new waste toner box until it clicks. Fuser. Turn off the printer and allow it to cool down. Slide the rewinder output roll to the side. Loosen the locking screw on the right-hand side and pull the printer forwards. Open the exit unit. Locate the fuser unit, unlock it by turning the blue levers and carefully pull it out. Insert the new fuser unit, align it properly and lock it by turning the levers back into place. Close the exit unit, slide the output roller into position, push the printer back into place and securely tighten the locking screw. Turn the printer back on and it will initialize the new fuser unit. Now let's change the belt and transfer roller. Start by opening the front cover and remove the waste toner box. Turn the lock levers on both sides of the belt unit forward to unlock them. Lift the levers to release the belt unit and carefully pull it out using the blue handle areas. Install the new transfer belt and slide it into place, ensuring it locks securely. Next, move the rewinder's output roll to the side and loosen the locking screw on the right-hand side and pull the printer forwards. Open the exit unit. Find the transfer roller and unlock it by turning the blue levers on each side, then gently remove it. Place the new transfer roller, align it and secure it by turning the levers back. Close the exit unit. Slide the output roller into position. Push the printer back into place and securely tighten the locking screw. Roller on multi-purpose tray. Open the multi-purpose tray and locate the roller. Pinch the sides to release it, then slide it off the shaft. Align and slide the new roller into place until it clicks. Close the tray. That's it. You are all set with your Plavi ES9542R press printer. Happy printing!